Without a doubt, the biggest dream of every single Shiba and you owner is that the token reaches $1 or loses some zeros, depending on how you look at it. So, when new projects are added to the ecosystem, many people think about how they can help make that dream come true and whether or not they are valid and useful. Well, it looks like we've finally found the thing that will make that dream come true. To find out what I mean, you'll have to keep watching this video. Disclaimer, starting right away. Bowen Shiba Swamp, which is the official Twitter account for Bowen, just posted something very interesting. The main point of the tweet is that SHIB can reach $1 because of two important things. Believe me when I say that you can't guess where this story came from. They say that the only way she will reach $1 is if as many people as possible show their support for Bowen and for Shibarium. Here's what they really wrote. Hashtag SHIB ARMY Hashtag Bowen ARMY Hashtag SHIBA Hashtag CAS the important question is what if everyone knows that the only way all of these works are because of Bowen? I'm sure you'll agree that this is an interesting point of view. They are basically saying that the best way to boost the price of sheep is to focus less on the token and more on another token in the ecosystem and the soon-to-be-released Sheeparium. Now, we all know that Sheeparium will be a big part of helping Sheep reach a fair price through burns, so it's not too strange to be told to pay attention to Barium. Some people might find it strange to be told to pay attention to Bowen. In fact, some people might be downright suspicious about it because it seems like the Shiba Inu ecosystem's main token, Sheep, is not getting enough attention from the long dev team. The main point of the argument is that she doesn't do much in the Shiba Inu ecosystem. One of the other two tokens is doing the things that it should have done as the main token. Some people might think that when the team talks about giving Bowen the most support possible, they are trying to take the attention away from Sheep. This is probably not true, though, because Sheepas may not play that many roles in the ecosystem. But the Def team has tried to make sure that every Sheba in U project helps improve the price of Sheep in some way. Sheebarium and the Sheba in U metaverse are both good examples, but if you disagree, feel free to say so in the comments. Still, we should really think about what it means to show Bowen the most support possible. If it's important to you for SHIB to reach $1, most likely, the best way to show your full support is to trade the token and try to get it listed on more crypto exchanges, both big and small. There could be more, though it could also be something completely different. Please think about writing down your thoughts in the section below. Also, if you thought this was really helpful, please leave a comment and tell your friends about this video. It really helps me with the YouTube algorithm, so I can keep making videos that are better and better. Moving on from that, the project's lead developer, Satoshi, who likes to talk in code when giving updates on the Shiba new project, just did something else that was very mysterious. First of all, he recently replied to a tweet from January of this year, which is strange on its own, but his reply makes things even stranger. He just asked her when she would bury him. Now, this comment is strange because he's asking the same question Sheep Army always asks him. I mean, he should be the one who knows the answer to that question. So, if he puts that comment under a post now, he's either making fun of the Shiba Inu community or trying to tease us about something. And if he is making fun of the Shiba Inu community, it is either in good fun or to get a message across. I think any of these could be true. But I also think that if we knew what post he made the comment on, we have a better idea. So, the post said, buy Shiba Wings, and it said, our Shiba Wings vision and brand. Getting real, keeping track of the days. Location Cavill Avenue Surfers Paradise. Well, I don't know about you, but I'm not sure what to do with this. Could Satoshi be hinting at some kind of collaboration between Roman 11 and Shiba Wings? Please tell us what you think in the comments. Speaking of which, Shiba Wings is an upcoming restaurant that will be all about Shiba and us. I think it's kind of like Welly, but it doesn't look like Shiba Inu is working directly with this restaurant, unless Satoshi's recent comment means otherwise. It says it is Australia's first and only crypto diner, so they must accept crypto Shiba Inu. There may be other Shiba Inu connections that we don't know about yet, though. Anyway, please tell me what you think. Everything. What do you think Satoshi's comment was about? And how do you feel about Shiba working with this restaurant? Talking about Satoshi and Shibarium, we all know now that the Valentine's Day launch guesses were all wrong. Before that, on a float day launch on February 10, 
the community was also completely off. Both of these ideas came from what Satoshi wrote about himself on Twitter. So, among the other things we've learned, this is a very important lesson about making sure to only get information from official announcements. Trying to guess based on interactions and Twitter bios hasn't worked well so far. Still, we might have to give Satoshi credit for not going into hiding after all these delays. But before we get to that, this channel gives away 100,000 sheep every day to anyone who wants to take part. All you need to do is subscribe to the channel, like this video, and leave a comment below. Hashtag Shiba Inu. Best of luck. Also, when you become a member, you can join a private group. If you want to talk about crypto gems, money, and success, you can chat with me. Click the join button. We only have four spots left with the information you'll get in the group chat. This could be the chance you need to improve your portfolio. Satoshi is always willing to talk to people, especially in the Telegram group. Even though this isn't the same as launching the platform, it's nice to know that the lead developer isn't hiding somewhere. What do they say then? I guess I should thank God for the little things. Anyway, Satoshi recently replied to a shareholder on Telegram, telling the person that he, too, was tired of being quiet and would soon be ready to talk with the wider community. Another holder complained that there is still no set date for Miriam's release and all Satoshi said in response was, you want an exact date? No, I don't have one because the release won't have a switch to turn it on or off. Now, we can all agree that Shibarium's release is taking longer than we'd like. We know that this platform has a lot of potential, so we want it to go live as soon as possible so that the Shiba Inu ecosystem can start to change. But regardless of how you feel, you might be able to agree that Zybarium is a big project that takes a lot of time. Don't forget that the project has only been in the works since last year. If you want something good and useful, we might have to wait a while. This is what the Crypto Basic had to say about it. Lucy, a well-known member of the SHIB community, says that developing the Layer 2 solution can be hard because SHIB Bellingham has so many possible benefits, such as a built-in way to burn. She let Kusama and the development team do it because she thought safety was more important than short-term success to make other people happy. But the wait can be frustrating, especially given how the SHIB and the new market is doing right now. But while we wait for SHIB Barium to come out, Maybe we could focus on other things, like burning sheep or getting a PayPal listing, as we talked about in yesterday's video. If you haven't already, you should go see it, or getting even more stores to take SHIB as a form of payment. Still, these are just ideas, so you should take them with a grain of salt. We've reached the end of this video. If you liked the video, please like it and don't forget to leave a comment in the section for comments. This helps me a lot with how YouTube works. Also, please let as many people as possible know about this video. Let's tell everyone about this.